I think it's important that NUS Business School are able to produce leaders who have this sense of adventure to think differently, to challenge the unknown. I remember the school as a place where the world opened up and got suddenly very big. Um, one of the things is uh, the breadth of knowledge uh, expanded. Another thing that sort of opened up amazingly was uh, social diversity. Interacting with uh, people, I think, is a very important element in the entire process right, of education because it helps to mold not just your character, but also more what you think the future will bring. Staying relevant today is about also building on your network, keeping in touch with your network and leveraging on the expertise and knowledge and capabilities of uh, the network that you know and, and network that you have. You basically have to make the best of the knowledge that you have accumulated, uh, reach you know, beyond what you thought your potential was. And I would say that uh, we should never stop learning. We have interns come in to actually work on live projects that Morgan Stanley is looking at. Projects like this will be useful strategically uh, to allow Morgan Stanley to look at expansion plans uh, in ASEAN. We have something called student consulting practicum projects. The students are taking a live problem, coming up with solutions, sometimes analytical solutions. Nine out of ten times, uh, the project is implemented at the company itself and that speaks well to the quality of the project solutions. We've been working with NUS for a little bit over a year. They're one of the world's best business schools and the students are hungry and eager to contribute in a real world situation. This consulting project is beneficial to us in the fact that we learn a lot from it. So it's a form of really giving back. When organizations come to NUS Business School, it actually shows that they trust us a lot because they are able to pass us their real-life problems. This actually shows the amount of trust that um, organizations have for NUS Business School. Research should not be done in isolation. It should be a collaboration between the public, private and academia. So if we can collaborate, we all can benefit in answering some very fundamental questions. We have got experts in our midst that are well recognized out there, there are the stars out there, but there are many stars in the making. And in that sense, with that fundamental solid base in research, creating the new knowledge, I'm positive that the school will continue to grow. We cultivate the development of a community with a sense of purpose, because we all have a caring heart to make a difference. As business leaders, we must set examples of ethical behavior, and good ethics are based on sound morals. I sincerely look to you and your generation to not follow, but to reset the standards of business ethics. Look for good people to be in your team. So that to me is absolutely critical. And for that, you need to be able to judge people. There's no point having a smart person who's got no integrity. That can lead you into a lot of trouble. Instilling the right values and having that moral compass uh, is very important. I complement uh, the leadership of the business school for striking the right balance in doing business, but doing it well and doing it right.